Hello boys and girls, Thomas here, and today I'm back with another video, and today, I don't know whether this is going to be an official start to a series or not, but if you want it to be, then it can be, but today, we're going to be start. well, we might be starting a series of Minecraft Survival on 1.16, on Java as well, on the big Java edition sign here, so, okay, so, this is not going to be a speedrun world at all, and I'm kind of hoping you guys will know that. Because I'm good at Minecraft, I'm just not insanely good at Minecraft. So, if other people join this world, then obviously they can. Because it's a server and... Are you kidding me? Well then, looks like we're starting a new world. Okay, so hopefully now... The server has refreshed. I've added a new world in. I've refreshed the world, so hopefully we're not on an island anymore. Perfect. So it's not a brilliant seed. Iron is down there. But it will do. It doesn't look bad for us, like speed running if there's a village nearby. But we'll sort all that out later. Just need to sort OBS out. Perfect. Okay. And the only reason I'm running, I'm not actually, do, I'm doing this as a server and not a single player world, is basically because I want to be able to do like cinematic camera stuff with a new account. So if I was to log onto a different Minecraft account and to like run around and stuff like that, it should all hopefully look kind of cool because you'll have like a camera swooshing in and around me as I. Like, Time lapse build stuff, so I think that looked pretty cool. But obviously, first we need to get the basics down, and I only reason I'm doing this is because I don't know if I really want to carry on Sky Factory anymore. And I know the views were amazing for it; the views weren't brilliant. I, I just counted myself. The views weren't brilliant, but the the watch time was. The watch time was really good, so. I'm hoping I can continue with a good watch time on this series as well, but I can only do as well as I can do. And yeah, so I'll try and talk a bit more upbeat and be a bit more energetic than I usually am. But compared to Toby, anything's brilliant, right? I am perfect. So we are going to be speeding through the beginnings of this, because obviously... This isn't really what you want to watch. I'll have to set up like an AFK fish farm as well later on. That'll probably be next episode. I don't have a plan. Like Sky Factory, my plan was to keep going, but obviously that got a bit dull. So I don't know how where this series is going to take, where where the series is going to go. To be honest with you, uh, I basically just needed something to film, and I thought, you know what? Let's do some stuff in Minecraft. Let's do a Minecraft survival. I was going to do a Bedrock survival, but. If I've already done like four of them on my channel, so if you want to go and watch a bedrock survival, watch them. This is not a bedrock survival. It's not hardcore as well. I don't re didn't really want to do hardcore, just in case. Okay, guys, quick update. I don't actually think I'm going to do. That was what I said. So let me quickly just stop the server. Stop perfect. I'm gonna copy this world file. Go into Minecraft single player. Uh oh, how do I do it again? Edit. Open world folder here. So this is the this is my Minecraft world folder. So we're going to saves. I can just copy in this world, rename it main uh survival and then this should hopefully appear in here. Perfect, okay. So now is this the exact world that we logged out of? It should be. It is. Perfect. So, obviously, I've made this world in... Uh, I made it as a server, but then I changed it to a single player world like that. Just so it would be a bit more, like, reliable. And I can install mods on it a lot easier if I need to. But... Basically, the idea is is that I will get this going, and then if people want to join and like make it a proper server, they can. 
and I'll just copy and paste the wall files like I just did then into a separate thing and then we should be good to go. So the plan for this episode is to maybe set up a temporary base. Not nothing big. But it should be good because we can set up farms later down the line in this series. It'll be fun. Did I get any wool from the sheep? Oh, perfect. I have enough wool to sleep. Okay, here, let's go and check this out. I do want to get better at min uh, Minecraft. I feel like it's something I could be good at because I've been playing Minecraft for years. Like, on my dad's Xbox 360, I started playing it. Obviously, not on PC, so that's good. Keyboard and mouse is obviously what I play with, but. I feel like if I get good at that, then, well, I'm, I'm good at keyboard and mouse. If I just, I know how to play, it's just actually, like, taking that and putting it into the game is hard to do. Now, I've kind of lost my bearings a lot. Like, a lot, a lot. I kind of put all my iron in that chest, in them. Furnace as well. Help. <laughs> How have I lost where they are? I didn't go that far away. Oh, there's a ravine there. That's good to know. I need to know where, it more, more, where my iron is first. Uh, hmm. I've been there. I'll, I headed this way because I can remember placing down that sandstone. It looks like it's not over this hill. Oh, it is. Okay. Whew, found it. No. Definitely was not stressing out them. And then boom. I don't really know why. Yeah, that is. Why is it saying that? I don't know what is happening now, honestly. I don't really know how this all works. But you know what? That is what it says on the thing, so... I always thought swords did more attack damage, but that must mean I'm obviously wrong. Okay. Oh, I got them the wrong way. Let's pick up this stuff, and let's head over to the ravine. Where's that? Where's the ravine? I lost it again. I'm awful at keeping my bearings in Minecraft, jeez. Livestream this world a bit, guys. Oh, I just accidentally smacked a bat. That is not... Hello. Oh, I forgot to make myself a shield. I knew I forgot to do something. I just went to block then. Okay, I need to turn some stuff down. Okay, so there is... It does sound like there's... Oh, there is. Okay, perfect. Yeah, that, that does not do 9 attack damage on its own, so... I don't really know how these numbers work. If you guys could... If you guys know, tell me in the comments, will you? I have no idea. And I'm filming this on the 8th of December, so it's not too long until Christmas. Obviously, I'll take a break over Christmas. It's either been my last or second to last video before Christmas, just because, yeah, I don't want to be st <laughs> making videos on Christmas. I feel like there's a lot more iron in Java, or is that just me? Because already starting off, we've got 48 iron plus full iron tools already. And this is going to be so much easier because uh, Redstone YouTubers like Mumbo Jumbo and stuff, and everyone on the Hermitcraft server really, they obviously play on Java. So instead of like on Bedrock, where I had to make everything myself, because none of my friends were good at Redstone and basically no YouTubers play on Bedrock, now uh, I can actually just watch some of the Hermitcraft series and copy some of their Redstone machines. Oh, hello. Hello. The difficulty is on normal, it did say easy, but I think I put it on normal. Yeah, normal, okay. If it needs to go up to hard, it can do. But for now, I feel like that's, that's about right. I don't feel like we'll need too much more. Obviously, this is just iron. 
And, and we did see that ravine, so I'll probably go there soon, just so we can get more than just iron. Because iron's good, obviously, we need loads of it. But we do need a lot more stuff than just iron. Keep I think keep thinking because I've been playing too much bedrock. Like, oh, coordinates aren't on. That's an issue. But then F3 brings up the coordinates, which obviously is a lot easier. You can also see my PC specs on the right if you're interested in that. And I'm going to add a link to the bottom of all my videos with the PC part list to my to the list of all the parts that are in my PC if anyone is interested. Oh my, what is happening there? This is this Minecraft Java stuff where if I update this, it'll flow. So now that there's not a village here, because this is this is a pretty decent spawn for a speedrunning world. And if that is a video that you guys want to see later, please tell me. Because I think it'd be quite fun to try and speedrun. Woo! Ow! Ow! Oh god. Okay. Uh this two of them great. Perfect. Okay. There's two of them! There's two! Oh, God. So, I think we went along here. I believe... Oh, no, we might not have gone along here. No, we definitely did not go along there. Where did we go? Am I going to have to watch back the video? Down here? No, there was no light. Jeez, why can't I remember where we went? We didn't run any further. We didn't go over here, did we? Oh, we did. Uh, hi, spider. Yep, isn't really the time. So I think that creeper blew up the other one. Thank God. Now I have armor. We should be able to explore a bit further down here. All the mobs seem to have gone. MLG. Hello. You having a good day, sir? Did you get a bow? No, I didn't get a bow. What Y level? That's my sword. What Y level are we at? We are at 34. <gasps> Diamonds. Okay, how many? Please be three. Okay, wait, what? Are these two separate veins? I don't really know what's happening with these diamonds, but diamonds are diamonds, so make sure we have enough inventory space. Okay, let's grab them now. Perfect. Okay. So this will be put towards a pickaxe and an enchanting table. We actually have the perfect amount for that. So that's good, obviously. I think I might start heading towards the surface now. I'll just take a quick screenshot. Oh, anything? Okay. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> hide, hide. Okay, okay. <sighs> oh my god, that is. That was so. <sighs> Oh, it's a cave spider as well. Okay, I definitely need to start heading up. Quick screenshot. Okay, I hope I can either edit it in post so uh, you can actually see what was going on down there. If I can't, looks like most of that part of the video is being cut out. And am I back in the ravine? We have literally hardly gone anywhere so we came up there and we kind of want to mark it out let's do that let's do okay let's mark that out so we know if we ever need a good cave we can just go back down there so now we're on the surface do i feel much safer no not really because stuff like that happens and you start to wonder how you're even alive anyway oh i've got bed why didn't i sleep Okay. Now should be all right because we can actually start doing stuff without constantly being shot at. We have enough to smelt it all, which 
perfect. And now, really, all we've got to do is make this. And then there is a lava pool over here. Open in the ravine. So while that is smelting, I'm gonna head over here and grab us some obsidian. And obviously we can go to the nether here, but I just want to quickly make an enchanting table first. I might be an idiot. It might be the way around here. It is okay. We didn't need three pieces of leather. I thought we did. That's fine though. Okay, so everything is actually smelt. Uh, I'm gonna try and make use of all the coal I have, which isn't much. But now, I'm going to quickly make two chests, just to keep us going. Just chuck everything in here that we don't need currently. Grab all this out. And then we need to make, obviously, the rest of our stuff. Perfect, shove this on. So now that's full armor. Plus a shield, I want to say, make it like this. You do. Perfect, okay. So that is now all the stuff I was aiming to get by this episode. So if you guys did enjoy, then please do smash that like button. Hit that subscribe button. I'll try and do a sugarcane farm out of episode. Just a little one to get it all sorted up. But for now, I will see you later. Bye!